The governor of Gibraltar is set to leave the rock next Tuesday. Lieutenant General Edward Davis is embarked on a series of farewells and today saw him visit GBC. He was received by CEO Gerard Deuma. We have to um, formally welcome His Excellency to uh, Broadcasting House. As a trusted news service uh, provider, we pride ourselves in impartiality and accuracy. Uh, that makes GBC kind of a go-to place for, for local news in Gibraltar. Uh, and uh, that is done at the same time of fulfilling our remit of entertaining as well. The governor spoke about the accuracy, honesty and sensitivity evident in GBC's handling of Gibraltar's news. As outgoing governor, thank you for the way that you have told the Gibraltarian story during the four years that, that I have been here. I think you've done it phenomenally well. Uh, you are a small organisation and to cover the, the breadth, depth um, and do so in a way where the quality sings true, the accuracy and some of the sensitivities that you have to, to cover. I believe that Gibraltar is at a, at a point in its history where the opportunities far outweigh the risks going forward. Um, but you know there'll be challenges to overcome to achieve that. But bringing the people with Gibraltar along through knowing what is going on so that they, as the people, because it's all about the people ultimately, can stay abreast of that and be informed about that and be reassured about that is, is a vital service to the people. Um, and uh, you know, I wish you well. I know you will do that very well indeed. As well as talking about the role of the national broadcaster generally, Lieutenant General Davis recognised with a governor's coin what he said were 37 years of extraordinary service by recently retired news cameraman Alan Guerrero. You know, we often talk about what goes on in front of the camera, and that's where the focus is. But nothing would go on in front of the camera if it wasn't for the people behind the camera and people like you who provide the skills and the ingenuity that to present the story and the people who are telling that story to best effect. Alan had some heartfelt words of encouragement for his former colleagues. You really don't know the responsibility you have until you leave GBC. How you touch lives of people. You realise that when, when, when you leave. And uh, I just hope you do have such a good time as I have had in this past 37 years. <laughs> An emotional moment for a professional who, through his lens, helped to document life in Gibraltar for almost 40 years. He said the opening of the Gibraltar border was one of the major events he captured. Will The Rock's departure from the European Union be spoken about in a similar vein in years to come? Maybe. GBC will definitely continue to tell Gibraltar's stories, including Brexit, with accuracy and impartiality.